Hi, uh, today we will cover uh, message design pattern implementation or MTP implementation. Uh, before watch this video, please log into my channel and watch uh, message design pattern introduction where I have explained what is message design pattern, what is the use of uh, message design pattern and I have provided some example. Uh, first watch and understand that video then come and watch this video so that you will understand this uh, uh, tutorial very clearly. Uh, so now we will see mes message design pattern uh, implementation. Uh, this MTB uh, has been used to implement or uh, facilitate uh, the implementation of other well-known design patterns like uh, uh, Ganga 4 design patterns, uh, DEO or uh, J2E design pattern etc. So using uh, this MDP design pattern uh, we can implement or uh, we can uh, uh, facilitate the implementation of uh, other uh, design patterns uh, like uh, J2E design patterns, DAO uh, etc. Okay, So using this design pattern we can implement other uh, design pattern very easily. Uh, in this video uh, we will see uh, using MDP uh, design pattern how we can uh, implement the proxy uh, design pattern. We can see M MDP implementation of proxy in this uh, uh, tutorial. So what is the use of uh, proxy is uh, it will just forward the message to the real uh, subject. We will see uh, in this sequence diagram. Okay. So here uh, you can see uh, this is the client side till this part. Okay. And here you can uh, see sender, uh, messenger and this is client side proxy. And in the server side, this is server side proxy and the receiver. Uh, now uh, sender wants to send uh, some message to the receiver for uh, some kind of uh, processing. So sender first uh, send the message to the messenger. Uh, we have uh, seen what is messenger in the message design pattern introduction. Uh, and the messenger will uh, forward the message to the client side proxy and the main responsible for the client side proxy is uh, forward the input uh, message to the uh, real uh, subject so in this case real subject is uh, receiver so it the this client side proxy will uh, just forward this uh, message to the server side proxy then um, server side proxy will uh, forward that message to the receiver the receiver will uh, receive the message uh, based on the instruction in the message uh, it will process this uh, message and uh, the output uh, whatever uh, uh, the receiver produce uh, that will be written back to the uh, server side uh, proxy so you can see the replay message here then the server side proxy will send message to the client side proxy and uh, client side uh, proxy will send the replay message back to the messenger and the messenger will reply back to the sender. So this way this whole communication will uh, take place. Okay. And uh, here uh, the important thing is uh, this proxy. So main responsible for this proxy is just to forward the uh, message uh, it is getting from uh, sender to the real subject. Real subject is uh, receiver. When if you see from this uh, direction, if you see from this direction, then the uh, receiver will send message to the server side proxy, and uh, from here the real subject is sender. So the replay message uh, has to be uh, sent to the sender. So in this way, using this uh, message design pattern, we can implement the proxy design pattern. Okay and uh, next uh, video tutorial i have explained uh, mdb implementation of uh, adapter uh, please log into my channel and watch uh, that video and uh, this is about uh, message design pattern and uh, thanks for watching bye